welcome back to my channel. So a lot of you know the struggle that has been trying to get my five month old baby to sleep. If you watch my vlogs, if you watch any of my videos, then you'll know that Hugo, my five month old, has just never been big on sleep for his whole five month little life. Sleeping has just never been his strong suit. The first three months of his life, we actually had him swaddled and that seemed to help. But they say that once your baby is strong enough to break out of the swaddle, you should transition them into a sleep suit or a sleep sack. Now we opted for the sleep suit because of his startle reflex. So newborns have a reflex, it's a startle reflex and it can wake them up. And it was waking Hugo up all night long. And so when we discovered a sleep suit and that was an option, it worked really, really well for us. So Crib Culture came out with this really innovative sleep suit, which apparently has this innovative sleep cool system that sort of optimizes comfort. Cause if you guys have used any other sleep suits, then you know that they tend to be really thick and bulky and you need to keep your room super, super cold so that baby doesn't overheat. I'm really excited to review and just kind of see what this sleep suit is about. I want to thank Crib Culture for sponsoring today's video. And yeah, let's open this up. Okay, so apparently this sleep suit is for three to nine months for 12 to 21 pounds. And Hugo right now, his last doctor's appointment was about three weeks ago and he was 15 pounds. So he's right within that mark. And this side of the box says that it reduces the startle reflex. That's perfect, because that's exactly what we've been trying to reduce. Innovative sleep cool system for optimal comfort, high quality breathable jersey, cotton outer and inner layers, easy roll flared arms and legs, adjustable v-neck and machine washable and dryable, which is great. All right, let's open this up. I'm really excited to see. Okay, <laughs> the first little thing inside says, stop, please read. And normally I skip right over these, but I'm gonna read this. It says machine wash cold, great. Um, only non-clarine bleach. Turn sleep suit inside out, tumble dry on low heat for 20 minutes. Turn sleep suit right side out and tumble dry on, tumble dry on low heat for 20 minutes. Remove from dryer, hold by shoulder seams and give a brisk shake and downward motion to like maintain the shape of your sleep suit if you're washing it. And then this says six ways crib culture improved the sleep suit. So if you are a fan of sleep suits and use sleep suits, these are ways that crib culture has just sort of up the sleep suit game, if you would. The first is a jersey cotton material. A double layer of 100% jersey cotton that allows us to make the suit thicker but not hotter. And that's big because the suit we have now is really, really thick and fleece. And I think if it were made any thicker, it would just like, it, it would be way too hot. Ventilation ports. Oh, cool. We added in an 11 inch ventilation port on each side. Mesh filled zipper expansion allows for easy cooling and offers a little extra room for chubbier babies of the world. That is perfect because Hugo is putting on the LBs. My little boy is getting bigger and bigger as each day goes on. And the ventilation ports are great too because we're going on vacation in a few weeks. We're going to a, a beach house and I was worried about how the sleep suit, our current sleep suit is gonna do in case it gets really hot in the house. So this might be a really great option. Adjustable neck. The addition of buttons to our sleep suit facilitate an important feature that was previously missing. You can adjust the neck size with the buttons to allow for better comfort and cooling. That's also a really great point because if there's anything that I've noticed of the sleep suit we're currently using, it's that the neck especially when I'm like lifting him up and he sort of slides down in the sleep suit a little bit, the neck can come up really, really high, which just, I don't know, it doesn't look very comfortable on him. Seamless back. Other sleep suits on the market have a seam directly down the back that acts as a ridge. Can you imagine trying to sleep with a ridge down the center of your back? A pacifier clip. We're all about making your life easier, so we've added a pacifier clip. Cool. And washer and dryer friendly. That is fantastic. Okay. So that's a little card. Here is inside. So lovely packaging. It says, welcome. We believe every product should inspire you and reflect your family's unique style and personality with modern looks that excite and style that goes beyond the ordinary crib culture products are designed for your crib. Oh, cool. Nice. And then it's got, I don't know if you can see that, but some more information in here. Pretty well everything that that little um, card had said. And then it just shows some of the other designs that the sleep suit is available in. And sheets that are coming in 2018. They are making organic sheets for your crib. Really nice. 
All right, let's open this up and see what the sleep suit looks like. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Wow, this is stunning. Look at this. <laughs> How cute. Okay, so right off the bat, it really does look very sleek and modern. So their whole thing is that they've made a sleep suit that is just a little bit more modern in design, a little bit sleeker because if you use sleep suits, then you know they tend to just look like big, it's like frumpy sleeping bags. And it's not like your baby going to bed is like going to a fashion show, but it is nice to have a sleeker, more modern option. And this just looks really nice and really polished. I also just love how big it is. It's really long, and if you have a longer baby, Hugo is five months, but he is, I wanna say about 25 inches long, and that's kinda of long for his age, and the sleep suit he's in now like stops like mid-calf. So this is gonna be a really, really great option. Ooh, and it feels really, really nice. So, oh, I wish I could have you guys feel this, cause the material feels really, really soft. And also I can see now that like the whole breathable aspect feels really lovely. These buttons are adorable. And then, okay, so they've got a zipper down the front here and the zipper goes all the way down to about mid leg. And then when you unzipper it, and there's a little portion here of fabric so that it goes over the zipper so that the zipper doesn't sort of bother your baby's chin or neck. And then in the inside, really fun chevron print. Um, you can see those ventilation chambers. So here is a really nice discreet side zipper and you just give this a little unzip here. And that is a really nice smooth zipper. And then you can see the little ventilation chambers on the side. My husband is going to love this. My husband is all about like sleek, modern, cool, in innovative, baby products and this is going to be like right up his alley. So those zippers are really nice. And then again, you see the chevron print on the inside. Um, here's what they were talking about in terms of the button down neck collar. So you can take the little flap here, this first button right on top. There's a little slit, there's a little hole there that goes right on top of that button so that if you wanna give your baby a little bit more room to breathe around the neck area, you can. And the same thing goes for the other side as well. This little flap goes right down there. And wow, this is just beautiful. Is there anything else in this box I should be looking at? No. All right. Well, I think what I'm gonna do now is wash this. I wanna wash and dry this before we give this a try on Hugo tonight. But man, this looks beautiful. Just like right off the bat. There's a little tag inside that says machine wash, cold, gentle cycle. And it's 100% cotton. The filling is 100% polyester. So the outer and the inner laying are 100% cotton. That is really lovely. Wow, I really like this. Oh, I'm excited to give this a try. Yeah, really cute. Also just a really nice option. It feels so light that I can imagine if you're getting ready to transition your baby out of a sleep suit because the sleep suit they're currently in is too bulky or just getting a little bit tight or a little bit small, this might be a really great option for that transition, right? So instead of going from sleep suit to nothing, this might be a really nice like going from a really bulky heavy sleep suit into this because it's so much lighter and it feels like it just has a little bit more room for baby to breathe. It might be another really nice option in that transition. What I'm gonna do what the plan is, is I'm gonna wash this. We'll put Hugo in it tonight. I'll try to snag a little bit of footage of him in it. And then I will come back to you guys tomorrow and let you know how it works. How are you doing in your bespoke suit? <laughs> All right, guys, it's the next day. And we got my little man with me and we are gonna talk about this sleep suit. Although he can't tell me explicitly that the sleep suit was super comfortable to sleep in, I'm just going to go ahead and assume that it was because again, the 100% cotton inner and outer lining just feel so incredibly nice and I can't imagine that that wasn't comfortable to sleep in. I really like that I didn't have to worry about him overheating in this and that we didn't have to like crank up the AC and the fan quite as much as we had been doing normally when he was sleeping in the bulkier sleep suits. However, I will say that 
Hugo is five months old and still has a startle reflex that if not constrained enough will wake him up. He also is like the king of nighttime flailing. So his arms and legs are just moving all over the place nearly all of the time. And so we found that to really kind of keep him asleep and to avoid those movements waking him up, we just need something that restrains him a little bit more. This suit is so light and so airy. It just didn't provide the amount of restraint that we need for him and that sounds so funny but I do think this suit would be an absolutely perfect product to introduce when we are transitioning him from being a little more restrained to one day hopefully sleeping without any sort of suit or wrap or anything. So I think that this suit is particularly wonderful if you are transitioning out of something that is a little is a little more restrictive. If you've been using a sleep suit that really restricts like limb mobility, this might be a really good thing to use when transitioning baby from that suit to nothing. Or if your baby doesn't move around a lot, doesn't have like a super severe startle reflex, then this is absolutely perfect because it does keep baby nice and snug. He couldn't like flip around. He couldn't take his feet all the way up to his head. But what was nice, and especially if you know that your baby self soothes with their hands and you were worried about them not being able to learn how to self soothe in a restrictive suit that won't allow their arms to come forward, arms can move in this. So I found that his arms, he could clasp his hands together and he could touch his face, which is great, right? Like if you're looking for something that is gonna restrain baby enough that they won't wake up, but won't restrain them as so much that they can't self soothe or like bring their hands to their mouth. And this is the absolute perfect, perfect suit. Again, for Hugo, because he's so animated while he sleeps, I think we need for at least this period of time, a tiny bit more restraint, something that's gonna be a little bit heavier and weigh him down just a little bit more. But I absolutely love this option and I'm so happy that I have this in my collection because I'm just keeping my fingers crossed that the next baby we have doesn't need quite as much restraint during the night and we'll be able to enjoy this sleep suit. So yeah guys that's my review on the Crib Culture sleep suit. I would love to make a whole video just kind of comparing and contrasting the couple of sleep suits we have so keep an eye out for that. Subscribe for more mommy and lifestyle content. Right Hugo? Thank you so much for watching and we will see you all really soon. Bye guys!